And then I'll be part of this too. This is going to be a fashion show in July in Farmington mm -hmm. where I get to share my son's story as well. So, mm -hmm. Good. yeah. You're a strong woman. Thank you. For Vanjie Randall Shorty, this booth is more than a place for information. Rather, it's a table filled with hope and memories, all for a son gone way too soon. I'm trying to stay strong. I'm still praying that, you know, we get, we get justice. But it's really hard. Pictures like these, just constant reminders. Zachariah Shorty was 23 years old when his body was found just outside of Farmington. It happened on July 2020, almost four years ago. I don't understand. They've got, they had Zach's body. They've got evidence. I just don't know what it is that they're missing. That's why she's looking for answers. And she wanted to find them at the 2024 Tribal Leaders Summit, an annual event hosted by the Coalition to Stop Violence Against Native Women. We're just so excited to be having, I think, about 18 uh, tribal leaders here, uh, you know, and kind of giving them a rundown of just like the current issues. While a majority of the summit focuses on the MMIP epidemic, leaders are also focusing on other issues from sexual violence to sex trafficking, even violence and bullying against kids. The opportunity serving as a huge gathering for Native communities across the state, like Governor Janelle Royball with the Pueblo Powake. She tries to make it out to every conference. Like they say, you learn something new every day. I think there's always something that I need to be more familiar with or a different um, technique, different resource out there. And Royball is thankful she's not alone. Leaders just like her vowing to solve problems so that families aren't left wondering and in the dark, still searching for justice. They say it's a small world, it definitely is. So we and whether it's a tribal member from another tribe or our tribe, we all feel it. Because as she says, it takes a community, and that includes grieving loved ones just like Randall Shorty. He used to tell me all the time, you know, through his music, you know, everybody's going to know Zach Shorty. So I think about that, think about him all the time. And, and I'm like, you know, Jawan, everybody knows you. Everybody knows you. Who, like some, isn't stopping anytime soon. All in honor of her baby boy. Reporting on the Isleta Pueblo, Brian Albizu, KOAT Action 7 News. <laughs>